Other news tonight, restaurants are slowly getting back into the swing of things now that they are able to partially reopen. Governor Northam gave businesses the go-ahead on Friday only if they can provide outdoor seating. News 3 reporter Nana Santio Bonsu talked to restaurants to see how things went this weekend. It was a different site on Granby Street. It was great. It was a blessing. A blessing to see people out and eating at some of their favorite restaurants again. We had a great turnout from our guests, a lot of our regular faces that we've missed over the past few weeks. For almost two months, businesses were forced to close their dining areas. But in phase one of reopening, restaurants can serve guests if they have outdoor seating. We're thankful that we have that space already set up as part of our regular uh, operation to be able to offer some extended dining to our guests. Even with the additional space, Olivia Gray, the operations director with Leone, says they're only allowed to seat 50% of their normal capacity. We're just going to continue to do what we can. And for restaurants like Chicho's that don't have outdoor seating areas, downtown leaders provided them with these barricades out here so they can still serve their customers outside. It's not as busy as we'd hope with the outside seating, but um, it's definitely a good thing still. To continue practicing social distancing, signage is placed outside restaurants on poles and throughout the restaurant as well. Guests must also enter and exit from different doors if possible. In Norfolk, Nana Saint Bonsu, News 3.